welcome to my channel prepping 101 I'm your host AJ and we're gonna have a good time I'm really excited about this channel and all the things that I'm gonna bring to the table here we're gonna go through a learning experience together I'm gonna take you on my journey of learning about prepping for anything natural disasters power outages essentially power outages I mean I know every single person has experienced um, losing power for some extended period of time and if not if you haven't experienced that then you're, you're either blessed or cursed I'm not sure which way to look at that one um, you should definitely have experienced life without power in today's day and age like there's not even there's what do you do without power like you can't operate anything everything we run in our lives is based off electricity everything everything I mean a power down situation you know, when you lose power if it's if it's winter time and you're in a you know, area where it's cold there's a real possibility you could freeze to death in your own house There's a lot of things. What are you going to use for light? Don't depend on just flashlights. These batteries are going to run out. They're going to die. And what if you can't get to the store to buy new batteries? What if the store closes down? What if the store can't operate because all their stuff's based on electric? How many of you have cash in your pocket right now to be able to run to the store and buy some essential items if you lost power and they the, the store was out of power they couldn't run your credit card you couldn't pay them you think they're just gonna give you that stuff for free I don't think so 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 what plan do you have to survive if something like that were to happen you have a plan and if not why not don't be that person that's that don't be that naive person that thinks nothing's ever gonna happen that nothing could ever go wrong because there's so many people that think that oh that'll never happen to me and then boom it happened to you and then you're SOL Because you haven't prepared for anything. If you prepare now, even if it's on a very minimal scale, to have extra batteries, extra water, I mean, the, the amount of water that we consume, that we should consume, it's about a gallon a day per person. That's the amount of water that you should have on hand for every person in your house. A gallon of water per person per day. So if you were out of power for a week and you had just two of you, that's 14 gallons of water. Do you have 14 gallons of water stored somewhere? I don't. But I never thought of it. And like I said before, the two things that really concern me and why I'm starting this, because I'm interested in doing it myself, so I want to start doing it and I'm going to share my experience with you guys and hopefully you can learn from that and hopefully we can grow together and, and see and, and learn from each other, you know? Because I know there's way more experienced preppers out there than I. 
sure I could learn a lot from them and I would be very excited to talk to them. Matter of fact, I have talked to one of them and that was the motivation for me to start this. And I'm, I'm real excited about this journey because I think this is exhilarating. No, that's a terrible word. It's not exhilarating. I find, I think, I am a, what the hell am I trying to say? I find that I have become passionate about this topic. Very curious and passionate. You know, I just have that feeling in my gut, like this is something I should be doing. So I'm going to do it, and I'm going to share it with all of you. But, if you aren't right in your mind, in your soul, in your spirit, with your creator, whatever you think that is, whatever your interpretation of God, your creator, source, angels, Jesus, whatever it is, it doesn't matter to me what it is. It matters to me that you are of, that you are at peace with whatever's going to happen in your life. You know? Build that relationship with yourself. Do, do the work there first. Because if you're not prepared in your heart and in your mind, Just having food and water around is not going to be enough to save your life. It's not going to be enough for any extended period, any extended period of survival in the worst case scenarios. And that's always been the motto of my life. Hope for the best, plan for the worst. Which, you know, I've always tried to imagine worst case scenarios and if you prepare for that then anything above that that happens to you anything less than that I mean anything less than worst case it's not that bad you know everything's about how you perceive it it's it's 80% mental you know in your mind Anyways, getting off topic. I'm very excited to start this with you guys. I'm gonna um, I'm gonna call around and see if I can get some sample packs from these companies for free, hopefully, but I doubt it. Um, I don't know. We'll see what happens, man. It doesn't hurt to ask, right? And I'll let you know about that journey and how it goes, and then I'll uh, I'll keep you informed. I'm so excited about this. I just like making videos, man. I like, I like sharing my knowledge with people. Uh, you, you know, if if you get anything out of it, then then great. If you learn any one thing from me, then awesome. You know. And I also want to do this as a as a video record of of my of my journey. You know, so it'll be a video diary. I'm willing to put myself out there and share with you. So I'm very uh, curious to what you guys think. So I know I don't have anything related really to prepping yet. But once I get set up, which will be very soon, I will sit down and we'll do some reviews. And uh, I really really hope to hear from you guys I have the email below where you can contact me with any questions concerns if you want to hear about any topics any particular things just go ahead and shoot me an email in this is uh, this is supposed to be a community effort we should work together you know worst case scenario 
in a worst case scenario scenario the more people you have the better if you have a community of people that you can trust I contend that you will survive longer than if you were by yourself that's how I feel about it that's what I think So, yeah, thanks for stopping by. It's my channel again. This is Prepping 101. You can contact me at prepping101today at gmail.com. Again, the link is below. All right, guys. I love each and every one of you. Trying to think of like a cool thing to say. You know? <laughs> I'll figure it out. All right, everybody. I love you guys. Stay tuned. I'm going to keep making videos. All right. Peace.